so it's been a very very um, early morning right now so I'm actually waiting for the tank to arrive so let's take a look at the whole build for today yeah <laughs> So the tank is actually finally here. It's, they are pushing it in right now. So let's take a look at the tank itself. Yeah. All right. So this is like the first time we are actually looking at the new tank build. So the tank itself is done by um, CRA. So CRA is a company that I really trust a lot um, when it comes to all of the aquarium manufacturing here in Singapore. So these guys um. It's currently they're installing the main display. So the main display is about two feet by two feet, and then it's a three-sided crystal glass tank. And then at the same time, the sum will go to the back right now. But this is how the overall tank looks right now. So we will get the sum in, we will get the plumbing in, and then from then on, we will show you the entire overall look of the tank built from there on. Right. So I shall not disturb these guys right behind me. So they are actually doing the tank right now so they're actually doing all the plumbing work and then the final arrangement of the tank so once this is done right then i will give you guys an overall look on the tank the plumbing and then um what is in the sum where is going where what is going what so that i will show you later on once they are done right behind me so you guys can see right so cra is like one of the best few tank manufacturers here so Right now, they're actually doing up is the plumbing work for the overflow box and then over to the sum. So, give them some time, let them finish this, and then after that, I will show you guys the overall on everything from then. Alright, so we actually finally are done with building the tank. So, it's a really, really, really hot afternoon, and then the guys from CRA has been working really, really hard to actually help us um, to build the new tank up. So big shout out to cra for actually heading over down to actually get the tank done so i'll leave a link down for you guys below if you guys want to get your tank done right um do check them out cra is a really really good brand out there that does really really amazing reef tanks and all the other stuff that they do so next thing i just want to um do a big shout out to reef market sg right for actually coming down here as well today to actually ensure that the tank goes well the equipments are well um planned they are well installed and yeah so why not let's just take a look at the tank from then on from now so we are actually taking a first look at the new tank that actually arrived um by cra so let's take a look at the tank at first so on top of it right this is a three-sided crystal glass tank so um it's about two feet by two feet and then two feet in height so let's take a look on top so over here we have the over the, the overflow box and then the return pipe over here and then on this side right we have the main drain and the emergency drain right on top and let's head over down so i've not really built up everything yet i just only finished on the electrical and the plumbing so what is going on right this little valve here that controls the down valve pipe so this will actually be the one that is going into the tank so this is the main return it will be going into this crash chamber over here before it overflows into the 4 inch fuel sock and once it's done there right it will come to this first section here so the first section is going to be actually be a um, protein schema area which um, reef market sg actually got us the bubble magus curve 5 elite so i will be doing a bit more um, walkthrough on this protein schema because this is a very interesting schema by Baba Magus. It's a, the first time that they are doing an elite series with the CJ pump. So I really want to see right on um, how good is the CJ pump and then how nice the foam will be on the elite model. So once we're done with the schema side, the tank will be moving over to this area here which is the refugium area. So this is the refugium section before it goes back to the return pump. And it will go into the return pump into the um, small little 11 watt UV sterilizer before it goes into the chiller and then the chiller straight back up to the main tank. So this should be all. 
the only couple of things that we'll be doing next right as um, we'll be adding in the schema the equipment as well as this little section here we will be adding in some biomedia and as well as the refugium light um, and then we haven't really considered what type of macro algae we want to keep inside here i was thinking to either go with kato or maybe something else but we'll see how this goes this will be a further update and then the tank itself is actually sitting on a aluminum frame that is done up by Prish Tech. So really do like their quality built over here. Once all the equipment is on, right, the acrylic panels will go onto the sides of the tank. And then at the same time, it should be an overall look of the tank already. And inside here, right, we are actually going to skip this tank next with the Carib Sea um, rocks that is actually also been given to us here by Reef Market SG. Then the wave maker, the Nero 5, the likes, everything will go onto the tank once we are done with the plumbing and so forth and so on. So if you guys like today's video right on our new tank build, we actually really come up with a name of this tank yet. So um leave a comment down below on what should we call this tank. I was actually thinking to call this tank the COVID tank build because this is actually being built during this um, pandemic period. So there are a couple of names that we will have or we will consider for this tank. Um, depending on what we want to keep in this tank as well, probably an SPS and LPS tank. And then at the same time, right, for the next few coming videos, right, we will be doing a couple more different videos on the tank in terms of the equipment run through, um, on how are we escaping the tank, to filling the tank up with water and then after that the first fish and the first coral that will be going into the tank but same thing if you guys like all the videos that we put out for you guys right hit that subscribe button and then i will see you guys next week